Who put cotton in the house? <laughs> Janae. Janae, who put cotton in the house? What's up everybody? If you're new here, my name is Deshaun King and welcome back to another vlog. I am actually on my way to go play bowling with Janae, finally. We've been rescheduling this for like several weeks, but I'm finna put the hurting on her tonight. So tonight I'm actually kind of overdressed. I have on this green set from Boohoo Man. You guys will probably get like a better look of it when I'm in some more lighting. You guys know I only have like a salt lamp in my room, so it's very moody in here. I don't really have that much exposed lighting unless I put up my studio lights. That's actually her texting me right now. So let's go ahead and meet up with my friend. Say you my nigga, then be no killer. Don't let me play with you and I'm with you. You switch like a <laughs> okay y'all so we finally made it to the bowling alley janae got her hair clipped because she thinks she's gonna pull her hair up and beat me i'm actually hella competitive i'm gonna whoop the shot in i wish you would <laughs> did you ever wonder you yeah, know you ever wonder what he might be going through on his own end the demons that he's facing alone and sometimes i can't go Guess who won? <laughs> it's me. I win. You lose. <laughs> we did best two out of three, I and I, I beat her. Exactly. And she won the first one. I ain't gonna lie. Before we start taking pictures, can we um go to Target? Sure. I didn't know Target still open. I want to try those uh candle earwax things. Oh, you you good? You good? <laughs> Trust me, I haven't learned how to shoot yet, so it's okay. <laughs> she was like, "Child, I thought you had a gun." Girl, we is not in the ghetto, or are we? We are. Are we? Okay. <laughs> Never mind. What's up y'all, back in the dark again. <laughs> this is gonna be basically kind of like a repeat of yesterday. I am going out with my friend Janae again, but I get to meet her friend Margo. We're not really like going out, 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 but we're gonna have like a little chill kickback at Janae's. I'm bringing my swim trunk because she wants to get in the hot tub at her place. I've never been to her new house, so. Let me go ahead and put my boots on because I'm actually really tired. I need to go because I need to eat something. Ooh, Janae, you cook, cook. Yeah. Fried chicken, cornbread, yams, mac and cheese. College, college greens. <laughs> Your house is very Pinterest. That's Cut, not cotton. cotton. That's who put cotton in the house? <laughs> Janae. Janae, who put cotton in the house? That was that was Stop. <laughs> like this. Set up to Alexa. So like, Alexa. Good night. I love Alexa. <laughs> Try something. I want to try something. Alexa, shut the hell up. <laughs> oh, she ain't say nothing. She, no, she don't like that. She don't like that. Like she don't like that. Who are you? Alexa, I'm surprised you didn't say play that. my favorite song. You haven't liked any songs yet. Playing your most played songs. Would you please welcome Kiara Sheer? What is this? Gospel? Gosp <laughs> uh, no, this is not church. Alexa, <laughs> stop. <laughs> These girls done went through a whole bottle of Casamigos. There's only a little bit left. Oh, that would be cute to put candles in it. Whose birthday is it, Jimmy? <laughs> it's Jesus. No, no. no. Jesus' birthday? New Year's Eve? No. Nine. No. <laughs> it's the New Year's birthday. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's cute. Oh, I love that. You have the best angle. I'm over it, top. Oh, okay. stop. Yeah, yeah you're so cute. What the heck? Girls love Beyonce. Girls love to fuck with your conscience. Girls hate when niggas go missing. This job, you ain't no different. These days, it's hard to meet women. Feel like my love life is finished. I've been avoiding commitment. 
That's why I'm in this position. I'm scared to let somebody in. No, 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 no. no. You know how this shit go. You got your best share of the fire. They call your phone. You try to act like it's just me, but I'm not alone. But if you're alone. Wait, ask me that question again. <laughs> so guys, today is Sunday. I'm with my girl Janae again. We are going to brunch. We're at this like new restaurant. Um, I've never been, she's been to plenty of times. I have on like this black blazer, black turtleneck, and then these jeans from Fashion Nova. <laughs> Why are we like this? Growing up black, we always order a cup of hot water to put our silverware in. And my mama always did that. Look at us, both of us got our cup of <laughs> <laughs> My body is your party, baby. Nobody's invited, but you believe I can do it slow now. Tell me what you want. Baby, put your phone down. You should turn it off. Just taking up all the parking space. Y'all, like why is he parked that way? Why? Taking up three, four parking spaces. We just left brunch. Brunch was really good. You know, that should be like one of our New Year's resolutions. Like, finding new places to have like brunch at. Me and Janae, we are always out eating. Always out always. eating. <laughs> We're always like sending each other TikToks like, oh my God, this TikTok in Orlando. Oh, this, this restaurant in Orlando. Oh, we need to go here, we need to go there. We're trying to find a place because I want a photo in this outfit. I didn't realize how much I was giving today. This jean boot combo is a look. And my glasses is a look. My blazer is a look. Everything is a look. And I'm gonna get photos of you too because Janae no. looks good. Yes, Janae. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I never want to take photo. <laughs> What's up y'all? So today is Wednesday, January 5th. I had to check my phone because I really don't know what day it is. Honestly, I'm trying to remember where I Y'all hear that noise? Y'all see that? I'm handling that. It's been making that annoying beeping sound for like the past two weeks and I've just been too lazy to change it out. But I finally went to the store and I got another nine volt battery. I've never done this before. And I decided to just whip my camera out and let you guys watch me do this because I've never actually seen anyone do this first of all it was like hell trying to get that battery off but y'all look at this first of all it's dusty because i never come up here i need to dust um but this little oh i'm trying to hold on i'm trying to scoop my my way across this little blue piece right here was so hard like getting off i can barely reach over but basically i'm gonna try to like put this on there but I don't know how, like for some reason it's not like, and it's really annoying and I'm really trying not to fall off and I'm so scared. <laughs> Let me see if I can prop y'all up somewhere. Oh my gosh, who is texting me? They're trying to get me to fall off this chair. No, I'm changing out this nine volt battery for my fire detector. And, and at first I really didn't know what the hell I was doing, but I'm figuring it out. It's so annoying. I had to send a voice note. And it's, I don't know why it's still making the noise when the battery isn't even in there. Does it fit? Like, is it? I don't hear any more noise. I think it worked. No, it's still doing it. Why? Why is it still doing it? I don't understand. Why is it still beeping? I think I fixed it. How do I put this thing back on? I need a dust up here. This is ridiculous. But I think I fixed it. I don't hear any more noise, thank goodness. I finally got my ASOS order. These were the rest of the clothes that I was waiting on for the collective haul that I was gonna film. Um, so I have some ASOS clothes. I have some clothes from Boohoo Man. I got some clothes from Minimal too. So, and I think I got some jewelry. Yeah, I got some jewelry. This is gonna be like my actual first collective haul, try on haul. So I really want it to be good. I was thinking about filming just the try on portion tonight because I do have a lot of stuff. I didn't really do much today. I worked and it was so annoying. It was so, so busy. Of course, working from home is a perk, but like I still couldn't leave my desk. Like I had so much to do. I deserve an Oreo break <laughs> before I start filming because that was a lot of work and that was really annoying. But yeah, I wanna make sure that I film enough of this B-roll portion tonight so that I can have a video to post on Friday. 
and then I'll probably post another video on Sunday and then another video on Wednesday. So I want to like kind of get back to posting like multiple times a week. So yeah, that's pretty much it. I will check in with you guys in a second. What's up everybody? So today is Thursday. I know it's been a minute since I've actually picked up this camera to update this vlog. I do apologize. Probably the worst vlogger in the world. We all know that's not true. I've just been super, super busy with real life. So we're just going to pick up right where we left off. I don't even remember when the last time that I picked up the camera. We have a lot to celebrate I have an announcement so I am officially monetized on YouTube I did a lot of crying yesterday a lot of crying if you're new to my channel if you don't know I started my channel September 2020 I've been on YouTube for about a year and four months and that honestly is a really big accomplishment for me. It's the first really big blessing of the new year for me. So I'm really taking it seriously and I really wanna go out and celebrate with my friends tonight. I cannot thank you guys enough because without you it would not be possible. Truthfully, this is like a very big step one for like the rest of my life for me. So I really, 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 really appreciate all the love and support. Everyone that watches my videos, everyone that comments under my videos, engages with me, follows me on all my social media. Like I have just like a handful of people that I know like first and last name that are always just supporting me. And I just, you guys don't go unnoticed. One day I wanna be big enough so that I can give back to the people that support me. My ride dies. Every time it was supposed to be ride or die and die. Anyways, besides all that, so tonight I'm going out to dinner with Janae and Desiree's gonna join us too. I haven't linked up with Desiree to hang out in like a minute. So we're gonna be going out to dinner. I think we found like a rooftop bar to go to. I have an appointment on Saturday for a haircut with Devin. Um, Devin was the guy that cut my hair last time. Um, I can't remember which Vlogmas video that was. I think that was my Christmas vlog. And he's like super chill. I love his shop. I'm gonna see if he has like any social media so I can like shout him out and stuff. With my girl Janae. She just got her hair braided. Y'all can't really see it because it's, it's in the dark. dark. We are on our way to a rooftop bar that's like beachside. Desiree is already there. <laughs> well, we need to call her actually. Oh, I'm Desiree Honeypit. Yeah? Hey. We're down to 59. 59? It's going down another. Yeah, tonight is supposed to hit like 55. Yeah. Okay, yeah, we definitely got to sit inside. Because I was ready to drink. I feel it. You know, you always be pre -gaming. Yes, I'm ready to drink too, that's right. I'm with you, girl. I need I know. I, I'm going to need me an appetizer in my stomach before I, I Oh, sit we know there. you, yes. Yes. I need a little bit of both. Shut up. First. <laughs> shut up. Uh, I'm so nauseous. Maybe because you need to eat something. I need, yeah. And like the car ride just felt like, ugh. <laughs> ugh. Like. And some water. Yeah, I definitely need some water. I don't think I've been drinking enough water lately. I pay very close attention to the color of my pee. This is probably TMI, but um, you know, I, pre every, I prefer you know. for it to be like clear, you know? And it hasn't been like the clearest lately. So I'm just like, okay, that's how you I need know. to drink more water. We made it to the bar. I need a pee too. I need to push some pee. <laughs> I need to push some pee. Oh, 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 oh. oh. I know it ain't, I know it ain't the stallion. <laughs> Desiree's such a good friend. She's just so early. She's so early. You can tell who the mom of the group is. <laughs> so responsible. Desiree had asked me, like, where do you want to sit? And I was like, I don't know, somewhere so aesthetically pleasing. And it's a bed. You understood the assignment. <laughs> uh -huh, uh -huh, I, I, I said, if we sat outside, we was going to get COVID. <laughs> I said, are you sure you want to sit on there? Well, I didn't know how we brick it was. I did not know how brick it was. <laughs> it's getting colder. It's getting colder. We have so much to celebrate. Janae, what are we celebrating today? We are celebrating. <laughs> it's like when the camera's on. <laughs> we are celebrating. <laughs> when the camera's on. We are celebrating. <laughs> it's hard. We're celebrating. We're celebrating monetization. That's me, though. What are yes. you celebrating? Oh, I'm celebrating my new employment. You a school teacher right now? She's a substitute okay, teacher. She ain't no school teacher. You can teach it though. No. Yeah. Like, wow. Yes. <laughs> Let me know how that goes. Please keep me updated. Girl, you're it's crazy. gonna be great. You gonna speak it into existence. Okay. Oh, we are. We are because you know mm -hmm. they're gonna like you though. So that's the thing that's gonna work. Mm -hmm. yes. What are we celebrating, Desiree? <laughs> so for me, we are celebrating um, my suite. It's about to open. Yes. 
Well, um, I'm about to be, um, my birthday's coming up, February 12th. So yes, Aquarius. Okay, first, and then oh, you're the day after my friend. Opening my own business. Yes. You know, it's levels to this. Yes. And, um, you know, it's a, it's a scary thing at, at times when you think about it. But, um, no, I'm excited. Yes. Because it is something that I've been wanting to do, and I know that I'll accomplish everything that I said I would, so. I know that's right. Okay, period. I know that's right. Period. New year, new beginnings. You know? New beginnings. Just, we all got new beginnings. Successful friends. I like it. Cheers to no drama. No, right? No drama. We eliminating it. No drama. No drama. 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 I don't like drama. I'm such an unproblematic person. Like I don't like drama. I'm so to myself. I have a select amount of friends I, that I can count on one hand. I don't like being in clicks, clicks, clicks. I should have put you somewhere where no one can find you. Mansion, not in sticks with nothing around you. Katie, Texas, Dallas, Texas, you know a different environment. You got desires. I know, I know. What's up y'all? So today is Friday. I'm at my dad's house because I got some things, some business to take care of over here. Uh, you get out. Get off of my bed. You stink. No. No. I'm not playing with... I'm gonna tell daddy. No. Yes. Daddy. Boogie needs his diaper change and he stinks. Go. Go. I'll walk down with you. Uh-uh. Hold on, y'all. Yeah, so I'm in, like, the upstairs area at my dad's house. But, yeah, I'm really excited because I'm going to be apartment hunting for my very first place by myself. I didn't do much today. I just worked. I had to get off, like, 30 minutes early so I can come over here. And I don't really plan on doing anything tonight. I'm just going to be chilling in the house. But tomorrow's going to be, like, a really busy day. I'm trying to find something to watch right now. And I was thinking about putting on Corella. I don't know if y'all have seen Corella, the Corella DeVille movie. But yeah, that's pretty much everything that's going on today. Uh, I had so much fun last night celebrating with my friends, with Desiree and Janae. We just had so much to like catch up on and so much to celebrate. We're going to get together for hookah soon. I'm just really proud of all my friends. Like we're all going into like our own successful lanes and like 2022 is really going to be like our year make more money more opportunities so i'm really blessed to be surrounded by like really talented and really just beautiful people but that's all for now that's all i wanted to say i will check in with you guys later okay so i finally have made it to the barber shop i'm 10 minutes late 12 actually because i had to take my little sister to work I did not know they wanted me to take her to work finally here hopefully he's not mad at me do I need anything I need lotion I need lotion I am ashy ah! and nobody had any lotion in the house and I forgot it at home I need lotion where's my bag okay I'm low-key in shambles it's a bit it's kind of deep in here I can never tell who's inside because they have 5% tent Your Instagram uh k-i-n-g D-I-S-H-O-N. Thank you so much. I do. Yeah, I found my main spot. <laughs> my my barbershop at home does not, they do not do mimosas.
So I got my hair cut. I'm so happy. I don't usually have it like this long, but um, I figured I'd just like kind of rock with this for now. That's probably the best barbershop I've ever been to. And I'm so glad that I found a place where I'm comfortable. It's really chill in there. They be serving mimosas and stuff up in there. So yeah, if you're in the Orlando area, go hit up my boy Devin with two ends at the end, two ends. And his shop is Exclusive Cuts. So yeah, I'll plug that. I didn't get his Instagram. So I don't know if he has an Instagram. All right, y'all. So we are now apartment hunting. Very, very nervous. I'm with Portia. I'm going to be taking y'all around today. I'm not sure how many places we're going to be able to hit. We didn't schedule any appointments. So um, we're just going to be um, available. But let me just make sure we don't have an application. It feels like a game today because we're just like going. Yeah. It's my first apartment. So. Oh, wow. Yeah. My first by myself, okay. I should say. Okay, come through the best life. Yes. <laughs> I'm going to live my, my best life like on TikTok. You know, the, the people that be waking up in the morning and then okay. they be doing okay. their stretches and <laughs> they go to get their haircuts. And <laughs> okay. Okay. So it is actually still available. Right oh. Now. So it is available. Now here's the thing. Uh oh. Uh -oh. So it's available now. Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you, don't hold yourself back okay. to accommodate anything else. So and then these are hard to come by. Are they? Really? They're so hard to find. Mm -hmm. And then keep in mind, March is tax time. That's true. Period. So Ooh. everybody going to walk in here and be like, okay, so I'm going to take it now. Oh, Why do you transfer the money to? Because right. they have their taxes. Uh -huh. <laughs> yes. Yes. So here's the thing. I, it's good to keep options open. Yeah, definitely options. But you can't sleep on them either. No. Mm -mm. They are one bedrooms are like trying to find an unpacked Starbucks line. Honestly, I would rather get food. That Starbucks line that don't have more than six cars in front of you, or that you can. Just so, like the one that we found this morning. That didn't have. They have five cars in front of us. Okay, so we were kind of lucky. Well, you know what? We're gonna be okay because you know who I have. Guess who I have. Us. And Jesus. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. God got me. Amen. Okay. No. So I don't know about this thing though. I don't know. I don't know about that. But let's see. Okay. Interesting. Okay. The little cabinet. Like the one in the second bedroom. Is this like it has a built in closet system? So you have shelves and all that stuff in there? Oh. Oh. Yes. Okay. See? Oh, wait a second. Oh, this bodied. Mm -hmm. So this is more like what the master bed, well, what the bedroom looks like in the one okay. bedroom. So if you would imagine, like this wall would be the balcony. But it'll be the I, like, I like the shelving, like the, the built in shelving. I could definitely do something with that. <laughs> Okay. Oh, yeah. Remember how we were talking about the linen closets? Yeah. You wouldn't have one. Oh, okay. So that's what you're going to have to use the chills for. Right. <laughs> My towels and stuff. Okay. Okay. Which I'm not, that's another thing that I'm not too picky about. It just depends on like the space and like what it offers. Or you could just buy like a little yeah. towel rack to put. Mm. Yeah. Like a little thing to go down the toilet. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Put you some cute little towels up there and a little yeah. basket and haul it in. Yeah, I could do that. Fine. Compiling a list of things that I need, so like yeah. cups, plates, yes, and and, and Amazon oh, you has first a, box of plates. Um, so Amazon well, has like the whole like first home starter kit. You nah. can get it all in what, one. Well, it's just like because I feel like there's a, a lot of things that I don't think about too. The brand of dish soap that I like, and my mother, she is definitely not no pets. No. Mm -mm. Thank you. This is fun. Having fun today. Great. Thank you. All right. And two, I am going to give you my business card as well. Absolutely. Thank you. And like you said, so we have the one that's available like right now, mm -hmm. and then we'll have one like later on in a month. So yeah. Oh come on, assistant manager. I know that's right. <laughs> 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 so I mean, if you want to apply like for it, yeah. See, even if I had a pet child, don't but I want to pay an extra five hundred bones just to my... <laughs> love on your baby. <laughs> no, and I don't even know how to take care of no pet. 
you just love them. Like, it's just, you, you change. I'm, I don't even want children. Right. I've always felt that way. Listen, why don't you want a baby? No. Well, I'll wait. It's too much of a responsibility. And that's, I never really had the interest to procreate. Gotcha. It just... I felt like I just, it's, it's going to be me and just me for the rest of my life. Yeah, you and me and Minnie Me. <laughs> I, I got Minnie Me. I got, got step brothers. That's fine. Okay, so we're at place number, I think, three now. Uh, we stopped at another apartment complex before we came here, but um, they weren't available to do tours or anything. They were like booked back to back for the day, but she did give me like the pricing information. So I scheduled an appointment to come back next Saturday. So I'm going to be back up this way next Saturday um, and we're going to do more hunting. So I'm really excited about that. The nice girl at the apartment complex is compiling like a little folder for me. So I'm just waiting on that. Make it be like a little snack. Some, some Oreos and stuff. Yeah, no, I gotta eat. I wonder if they got water. Oh. Come through snacks. Okay, I feel better now. It's been like a couple hours since I've had breakfast, so I do need like a little pick me up. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good, thank you. You said you're looking for a bedroom. Uh, yes. Perfect. What time frame are you moving in? Uh, probably more September. For, uh, that is uh, spring summer. Okay. September spring show um, spring summer. And how does your um, pricing for rent like fluctuate? Because like, we've been it to places where every day. every day. Okay. Yeah, and everything's computer generated, so that's all. You just gotta keep checking the website. What were the qualifications as far as like? Here um, we qualify three times the base rent. Okay. So three times the base rent and gross income. To qualify, the application is one twenty five per adult. The admin holds your apartment and covers the paperwork. That's one hundred and fifty dollars per apartment, and then your deposit can be from one hundred and seventy five up to a full month, depending on how the application comes back. Okay. Your water and electric, you pay through simple bills. It's only five dollars to set up. So the way it works is just connect yourself to the apartment. <laughs> Like we're both just like over it. Can you just take a picture? <laughs> so, no, I got my ID when I was like a junior in high school. I'm like, oh, my. I'm like, oh, so we're about to look at a place. Um, we're about to look at two places actually. One's on the second floor and one's on the third floor. So I'm really excited. This has been a fun process so far. I won't have any in the time frame, but I just want you to take a look at it. Okay. I like this because it kind of gives me town home just a little bit. So there's like stairs going up. I love up. the smell of here. Yes, I love it. It's not. You just have the carpet change. Oh, okay. Me? No, I'm not gonna help you. Okay, so it's it's all carpet. Um, yes, besides the white areas. Okay, I love this. I love this. This this gives too. And then I'm guessing the washer and dryer is in there. Correct. Okay, that I don't mind. Kind of like tucked away, and I low key. I was gonna say I can low-key use this for storage, but no. Um, okay. Okay. Cabinet. Okay. You don't cook. I don't cook now because I don't have the space to cook. This is not screened in, right? No, none of our okay. are screened in. What is this door to? Storage unit. Oh! Oh, stop it. No way. So the Christmas tree can go in here. Yes. Okay. And all other knickknacks. Great. That's one thing that I look forward to, like when in the bathroom, if you turn the light on, if it makes the noise automatically, or if it has like a separate switch for that. Um. Yeah, because I, I can't I can't stand that fan noise. Okay, bathroom. The lighting is nice in here. And this would be my bedroom. Um, we gonna have to do something about them switches though. I don't know about that. So the walk-in closet is not that big, but it's probably because I have two separate storage units. But I still want some closet space though, because my clothes and my shoes. And when you say classic, are they like kind of less modern or? Yeah, so, have, so like think about like early 2000 apartments. Ooh. Yeah. But they still, they're still in really good condition for how old it is. I know it's like 22 years old. Mm. <laughs> but like, they're in still in really good condition. And the tiling, it won't look exactly like this. It'll kind of be like a white overlay. 
I do, I do like this. Do like I do. Like yeah. I can hurt myself on this. I love doing my nails on here. Yeah. Like <laughs> <laughs> I know this would be like a nice area because I do YouTube too, obviously. I'm like vlogging my whole process doing this. Um, so I do look for like spaces where I can have a filming setup. In this area. Well, I would probably do it over here by this window. My new place having like my window being behind oh. me when I do sit down videos and just kind of like, that was like my idea for that. Um, or I could maybe use it over there because I don't know if I'll even have a dining area. I'm not sure if I'm like interested. So how would you invite us over for dinner? Well, because I wouldn't, I would just go over your house. For dinner. I'm not cooking anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I already got the ring. I'm good. I'm I just anymore. I don't know. I mean, maybe I'll have a dining room area. I don't know. It just depends on like I idea. Think you should. Maybe two chairs right here. But then you would clutter your entry. I was just about to say you wouldn't think it would just clutter like this yep. whole. Cause yeah. you gotta walk up and be like, up. Oh. Man. I don't know. Your sofa here, TV there. Papa's grass goes in the corner right here. I already know. Okay. So first we have to get it. Right. I like this. I like this, one better. I like I this like better too. You lost a little bit of living space. space. But you, I love the French doors. I love the French doors. I like this. this is classy. It gives. I, want to get away I love this room. It's so spacious. I really like this. You can even film in here. Yeah. I could. Yes, because my filming setup would be in this little corner right here. What is this um this thing for? That is, I want to say, security, phone, or Wi-Fi. Oh, so my wi router can be wi in here. Yeah, okay, wi that makes sense. It's like it's one of those. Yeah. Okay. So you can film here. You can put your workstation out there so you can mm -hmm. get up out of bed and go to work. Yeah, my little office. I can, cause I do want to have like a separate office I, space to sit down. If you're gonna down. film there, I will put my bed this way. Yeah, yeah. Headboard this way, and then that way you can mount your TV. Mm -hmm. here. Right there. I like that. I have a Nintendo 64. What kind of games do you guys have? Oh my gosh, I don't know to be honest. Do you, like you have a lot? Mm -hmm. That's because you guys want people to come here and like. Mm -hmm. See, a lot of these like entertainment uh, areas where these apartments have, they'll stage it nicely, but they don't really like have, they don't give like people in a sense of like, hey, come hang out here. And we also have games on the shelves too, so you can come and play with your friends, and we also have a the TV there as well. And how, is this available during? It's open during office hours, okay. so 9 to 6, Mondays to Fridays, and 10 to 5 on Saturdays. Okay, okay. Because I know there are some common areas too where if you have a code to get in, after mm -hmm. hours and sometimes that's probably what we're going to see in the new changes hopefully fingers crossed that's probably what we're gonna i see. hope so because this is nice because i would i would bring my friends here and we would we would hang out like I you know 8 p.m 9 p.m like seriously this is really good to have board games and stuff like you know like <laughs> i'm actually really impressed I like this a lot. Thank you for showing me this. Cody got me nodding, got me nodding. Yeah. Update for my day. I'm actually at the Florida Mall right now. I am going to possibly get a new phone. Possibly. I wanted to walk into AT&T and just see, you know, what my options are. Because I want to get, like, the new um, iPhone 13 Pro Max. Because, one, the camera on it goes crazy. And um, two, it's like time for me to upgrade my phone anyways. I had like my phone on like an installment plan because who's going to be dropping like a thousand something bones every time a new iPhone drops? Not I. Not I. I want to go in here and just see like, you know, what my payment options are. Um, and I may get a new phone today. I don't know. Um, I also wanted to pop into Zara. Um, I'm not sure if they have the full size ebony wood you guys know i have the travel size but i'm hearing that a lot of these zaras are hiding the ebony woods away from the customers for some reason i don't know why but that sounds lame i don't need to bring this big telfar there's no reason for me to do that um so i'll just leave that in here driving in orlando is so f crazy you guys like you have no idea like these people they're wild and sometimes it can make you nervous especially if you're on i4 which is like the busiest highway in the country after the, i leave the mall today i actually wanted to go find like a hotel and take some photos for instagram but i'm not quite sure what hotel spots have like good um lobby areas because there's 
guys know my photos, I look for like neutral backgrounds. I came to the wrong mall. I thought there was an AT&T store here and there's not. And I'm looking at all the AT&T stores in the area and they all closed at 8 and it's 8.19. I guess it just wasn't meant to be tonight, so I guess I'll just get a new phone another time. But while I'm here, I might as well just check into Zara and see what they have. Okay, so I just left Sephora and I'm just gonna go back to the house. I don't know, the vibes are just kind of off today. Like I went to Cinnabon to get like a little snack and the workers were so rude. Like they didn't, they barely made eye contact with me. I went up to the counter, they didn't say hello, how are you, none of that. Like, I don't know, I'm, I'm very big on customer service because I used to work retail and also food service for a couple months. So I, I know what it's like. Like I know it's about to close and like y'all tired, y'all wanna go home, but you don't, you don't treat people like that because yeah, no, that's just, that's just rude. Hey y'all, so today is Sunday. I'm actually getting ready to head out um, to run a couple of errands. I haven't really been doing anything today. I actually just been laying in bed, scrolling on TikTok, and I was actually in the middle of editing a TikTok slash reel. Usually I try to like keep my reels and TikToks pretty much the same. Um, so I was like in the bed editing that. I need to find like an undershirt. I didn't bring a tank top. Now, bask in every single moment. <laughs> Don't even paint me blue. <laughs> Child, let me get out of this car. So I'm at Publix. Right now, I just dropped my little sister off. Always on low battery for some reason. I just never charge my phone. I just want to be in and out of here so I can get back to the house. I don't know what it is, but the, the atmosphere lately is just really off. People have been behaving quite weirdly. And I, I don't like it. I don't know, it's like people are more disrespectful over the past couple of days and I just don't appreciate that. Yeah, I don't know what it is. I'm just gonna lay low, keep it chill. I'm not even in the mood to like take photos or really do anything content related as far as Instagram. Oh, it's a full moon too. That's probably why people are acting nuts. Jesus, it explains it all. The most embarrassing thing just happened. So I was literally at the wrong car. Same exact Jeep. Same exact car. Literally, it's feet away. And I'm, I'm sitting there, I'm like, why isn't the key fob working? And then I press the lock button so it can make like the beep sound. And I heard it, I turned around, I'm like, oh my gosh, you gotta be kidding me. Hey guys, so today is Wednesday. I would never, ever, 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 Tiffany. Ever show my room like this. I like to pretend that my life is perfect, like the Virgo that I am, and that is not true. My life is not perfect. It's time for me to come clean. Literally, <laughs> pun intended. Pretty much since the year began, I've been feeling depressed, but I guess I wasn't really, I guess I didn't really recognize that I was feeling signs of depression, but it's the fact that I had like zero energy to get my work done, one, to keep up with all of my friends because I keep a very small roster, but as of lately, I've only been keeping up with just like one or two. And that makes me feel bad because I feel like I'm neglecting my friends. And I know when I'm not feeling the best or when I'm going through something, I isolate myself. And that's pretty much what I've been doing too. Not being consistent with my channel because as of today, I posted a video nine days ago. And that's not, that's not necessarily bad, but that's unlike me. Like I'm used to like having a video at least two times a week. You know, I noticed just like my energy has been low. When the year started, I felt like 
wow, like I have so much to do this year. Like my life is going to change so much this year. And I think it kind of freaked me out because I actually have a lot, you know, a lot, a lot on my plate. And it does feel overwhelming to the point where I don't feel like doing anything. I don't know. I just wish time would stop and stand still for like a week so I can collect myself. Yeah, that's basically what I've been going through. That's why my room looks a mess. Like I can't operate like this. My face looks a little shiny right now because I have on this uh, Versed Instant Resurfacing Mask that everyone's been talking about on TikTok. You guys know that I did like a review on this when I did my drugstore skincare routine video. If you haven't seen that, I'll link it above so you guys can check that out. But I've been seeing like a lot of other influencers and people talking about this online. I was like, that's so strange. Like I literally reviewed that product months ago and now all of a sudden it's blowing up. Actually, I need to FaceTime my friend Basial because I want to be on the phone while I clean so I can like get it done quicker. Making a FaceTime call to Bashel Lewis. Mobile. It's the stealing for me. You always. I'm always what? Doing it. Oh no, you just in the dark. It's used to the dark. Anyways, seeing as though that I just exposed my entire life to the world just now, I'm gonna go ahead and prop you guys up so you can watch me clean and get my life together. I went ahead and I finished cleaning my room for the most part um, there's just like a couple of little things that of course can wait until tomorrow but I feel so much better and right now I'm laying in bed getting ready to fall asleep and watching Aaliyah's new vlog that she posted today 
it is now 1.46 and I have no intention on being up this late at all. I'm tired of this lazy cycle that I've been. So yeah, it's time for me to get it together. So I'll see you guys in the morning. What's up y'all? So today is Friday. So yesterday was like really annoying for me and it got to the point where I was just like, you know what? I cannot go to work tomorrow. So I went ahead and I called out of work and I'm taking myself on a self-care day. I'm gonna get a pedicure, I'm gonna get a manicure. I woke up this morning, I was just like, F it, I'm just gonna go ahead and call out of work. I never, ever, 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 Tiffany. Call out of work. I, I can count on two hands how many times I've ever called out of work, ever, since having a job. And this was probably like my sixth or seventh time like ever calling out. This is real black luxury right here, just calling out of work and doing whatever the hell you feel like, to be honest. I spent basically my entire morning in bed on TikTok because I was so just exhausted and tired. Like, I feel like I've just been overworking myself. I gotta shift the energy in my life, you know what I mean? Like, I, I gotta, I gotta get it together. My self-care starts on the outside and then we can work about, we can work on the inside later. I'm good, how about you? Can I get a um, iced chai latte uh, with oat milk? Iced chai with oat milk, you got it? That's what you want to now. All right, thank you. How you been? I've been good, how about yourself? Yeah, you know, working. <laughs> same, old, same old thing. Oh yeah, I, I called out of my job today. I just said oh, it. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I was like, uh-uh. <laughs> I was like, you want, no. You wanted the vlog instead? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I gotta take care of myself today. Exactly, exactly. Alright, there you go. Thank you so much. No problem. And enjoy. Alright, you have a good day. You too. Good to see you. Nice to see you too. We're good. Okay, bet. I feel so energized and refreshed. That was like the most relaxing experience ever. It was kind of awkward because their system was down for like 20 minutes, so I had to like cash app them. Just a little bit ghetto. Ciao. The AC is out at Panera, y'all. I'm like, what in the world? I asked the girl, I'm like, it smells a little musty in here. Like, is it, is it just a musty? Yeah, so I'm just eat outside because it is hot and stuffy in there and it smells very musty. After I eat, I want to go ahead and pop into AT&T because I want to see about upgrading my phone and like how much I have to pay because I have my phone on like an installment plan because I don't know about y'all, but I ain't got 1200 bones to drop on a new iPhone every time it comes out. So yeah, it's so brick. I'm walking into AT&T. Hi. Do you guys have like all the 13 Pro Maxes in stock? Well, like the colors, at least. No. You don't. The light. Oh no, <laughs> no, I can't do that. Uh, we can order it. What are the different color options, actually? Gold, white, black, and blue. Yeah, that blue is really turning me off. <laughs> I was you like, put a case on it, right? Uh. Okay guys, so I went ahead and I ordered my phone. All the stores only have one color, and guess what that color is? Blue, ugly ass blue. Like, I'm not finna get no blue iPhone. I'm walking into Target because it's literally like right next to AT&T because I didn't bring any 
body wash. And I need to hurry up and get in here because it's so cold. Listen, seeing you got ritualistic. Cleansing my soul of addiction for now cause I'm falling apart. Tension between us just like big fences. You got issues that I won't mention for now Cause we're falling apart Passionate from miles away Passive with the things you say Passion up on my own What's up y'all? So today is Saturday. This is actually going to be the last day of the vlog because I already know I have a lot to do today. I'm going to be apartment hunting later on today. It's almost been two weeks since I last posted a video because uh, I wasn't in the right mood. So as the video has been going along, I've been feeling a lot better. Right now I'm in the Starbucks line. Um, about to get some breakfast. Hi. Ooh, it's so cold. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I like it too, but I don't, I'm not dressed appropriately. Um, <laughs> can I get, uh, let's see, what is this order? Can I get two classic oatmeals with almond milk, brown sugar? Oh, you, oh, the oatmeals? Ooh, okay, let me, hold on, because this is someone else's order, so let me call. Hey, they're out of the oatmeals. <laughs> Yeah, Portia, they got the Starbucks workers out here like it's um, Chick-fil-A outside. It's yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. You too. <laughs> How do I get out of here? Oh my gosh, it's deep. It's a Saturday. School ain't in session. Where are these? <laughs> Y'all, I'm so glad I never went to a PWI because culture around here is very different. Oh, I didn't know they had a Del Taco over here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Can I get two bacon egg bites, please? One, one order of two or two ba or two orders? Oh, two orders. Can I have two cheese danishes? Okay. And then that's it. Anything else? Uh, that's it. Okay. 1683. Okay. Do you guys have Apple Pay? Yep. Cool. All right. So I, I look, uh, let my guy over warming now. <laughs> awesome. Thank you. Alrighty. Well, then I'll need a snowman. All right, bet. Where are you going to today? Uh, well, actually a lot to do, yeah. I yeah. have apartment hunting and stuff you like that. Mm -hmm. Got any other plans for the weekend? Not yet. Here Thank you, you. Have a good one. You too. Dang, give me no bag. I'm supposed to just carry all this. Anytime drive through workers engage in like small talk with me is so awkward. And, like It always catches me off guard because I, I, I don't be expecting it. So it's like, um, do you really care about my day, sir? I don't know. Let me try to figure out how to get out of here and then I'll check in with you guys later. Bro, my entire personality has become TikTok. Like, there's no turning back, I'm fearing. Okay. All right, so I actually just put some clothes on. We're getting ready to go to my apartment appointment. It's like in 20 minutes, basically. So hopefully we're not running late. The bathroom is a mess because I was in the middle of filming my shower routine. Shower routines probably take like a good three to four hours to film. Like if you really want to be thorough and aesthetically pleasing with it. So that's why I'm not done yet. I got pretty much like half of it filmed. It's 2.42 right now, so we should just go ahead and leave. But yeah, let me go ahead and put some shoes on and then we can get going. Okay guys, so we're about to walk into the place for my appointment. Hi. Hi. How can I help you? I had a three o'clock appointment. Three o'clock? No, you don't have any. <laughs> What's your name? Dishon. No. Mm -hmm. Are you on my list? Yeah, um, I spoke, t I think uh, she was right here. Last oh, okay, weekend. sit down here. Let mm -hmm. me check, okay? Yeah, I have an email too. Because I have, let's see your email. Because somebody came today and the uh, people, this uh, person, supposed to come on Monday. Not today. I have people coming now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
122. My goodness, it has a little in our system. Oh. But that's okay. Just a little. Let's see. You have three o'clock? Mm -hmm. It's 310. Yeah, I have, I have called to, I have called to left a message to this. Probably <laughs> that phone over there blinking. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, that I was on the way because we were in some traffic. Okay. Is okay for you? That's fine. Okay. Do you have any places to tour today? We have only the model. Our model is too bad on so bad. It's totally different. It's another floor plan. But you can see inside. Okay. Right? Yeah. Okay. The amounts, you are looking for the smaller one, 620 square feet or the 850? Um, either you one. Yeah. Okay. Then, it's like this. The 620 starts at 11.76 and the 850 starts at 12.96. Okay. This means that in the basic amount is included this amount. And this amount is in here already. Mm -hmm. Okay? And this amount is included water, sewer charge, pest control, dot to dot trash valet, liability insurance, and wash and dryer. Okay? Oh, nice. You pay only separate electricity and um, your cable and internet. Okay. Okay. Um, also, in your moving day, you uh, pay uh, administrative fee and uh, uh, utility fee. Okay. But the next month, you're going to pay all your uh, monthly amount. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the uh, application fee is $75 for adult and uh, it's not refundable. Mm -hmm. Okay. For being pre-qualified, you need to make at least 2.75 over the leasing amount, mm -hmm. the gross amount monthly. Okay? Okay. This is for you. Do you have your ID, please? Yes. Okay. It's strange. I don't know why you are not in our system. Yeah, that is weird. Yeah, I'm going to check because something... Stranger things have happened, so yeah. <laughs> thank you so system, much. System, right? Mm-hmm. Internet. System. Shut up! That is so stupid! Oh, you here? Yeah. You are under my name. Yeah. You say it's under Ashley. Because of this, I say. I oh yeah, I don't know who she put me with. I just okay. know that she like put me at three. All right. But yeah, at least I'm there. I'm here, anyways, right? Mm -hmm. We can go. Let me just receive. I know. Okay. Important for Monday. This is here, and I have this. This. You can go in your car because our golf cart is wet. Oh, okay. And dirty. I just know that she put me at three o'clock. I walk in there, she's like, "Oh, what? You're not in our system. I don't. You don't have an appointment." I'm like, "Did you even check?" She checked her computer. She's like, "Oh, this, this Sean. Yeah, yeah, you're, you're with me." I'm like, "Okay, you know, it's." She's just weird, and I don't like the way she's talking to me. It's, it's very like. How is she talking to you? She's talking to me like very. Condescending? Yeah, yeah, like I'm slow. I actually didn't even get her name. And I, I need to ask her what her name is. She at her desk writing little sticky notes and stuff and leaving them. And Oh, the, yes, I need to, this is for Monday. And this is for Monday because I'm not here Monday, Thursday. So give me one second. And I'm just like, okay. Like, all the place. like this, okay, like you chewing up my appointment time and you claim you got all these people coming and you want to sit and do office work when you could be taking me on my tour is yeah no I don't like it she was like yeah you need to you have to drive because the golf cart is wet okay but you're riding in the golf cart <laughs> I would have been like but I didn't try I got to I ubered here Oh, Uber. Then at that point, she would have had to let me sit in the golf cart. But I'm just like, all right, whatever. I don't no, know. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be petty. So my child had a tour scheduled on Saturday. And the lady there was very rude. Um, she basically told him he could not walk or ride with her in the golf cart because it was wet, that they weren't going to take the golf cart. But then she... And she said that there's no one bedrooms available, even though the girl said that they had some available so we're touring the model right now and it's like for a two bedroom two bath okay. just i don't she's getting on my nerves Ugh. all right the amenities are great though <laughs> 24 hour gym oh yeah what you say and the tv does work out plans uh, <laughs> this is our model. oh it smells so good in here 
Yeah. <laughs> the the wall will be only that color. This is the model. Okay. And the kitchen will be the same. Just uh, change the size. Everything will be the same, but very smaller. Very smaller. And okay. we have a wash and dryer outside. I actually really like that. It depends because like on a day like this where it's cold, yeah. you don't want to do laundry. Yeah, for sure. Okay. And you want bed on a bed to be stackable. Oh, they'd be stackable? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. And are they the same type of washer and dryers or? It's the same time, yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Would this be considered the master? Yes. Okay. Nice. It's not too bad. I've had a shower head like that before. Shower heads like this are so powerful. So all of them have everything that's like. Everything the same, but the color is only one color. It's the gray one. The closet space for both bedrooms are pretty much. Yeah, that's awesome. I don't really. Oh, and this like this is like an extra it's storage. Two bedrooms only. This is like a linen closet. Yes. Do the one units have a no, linen no. closet? No. no. Okay. It's very small. Okay. The only linen that the one bed one bath has is one inside of the bathroom, but it's very small. Okay. Yeah, I think we're I think we're done here. I'm not living here. There's no way. What happened? She was like rushing me out. She's like, I was like, okay, and do all the yes, they're all the same. Yes, they're all the same. Exactly the same. Yep, they're all the same. They're all the I'm like, okay, and they all have the same. Yes, yeah, like just uh-uh. Uh-uh. Nope. I'm not sure I understand. We I don't understand you. either, Siri. Alexis from Selling Tampa could have done a better Bitch. job. Mm. Left a bad taste in my mouth. It's okay. I'm not leaving bad taste in That was interesting. I had never had no experience like that. Yeah, I don't like that. That was not a good experience. And that, that kind of thing turns you off from like a really good place. Like this place is beautiful. Like I guarantee you if I had like a person that was like really nice and like took their time and was like patient showing me and, and, and volunteering information, I guarantee you I probably would have put my application in. But I'm, I'm kind of hesitant because I feel like this is a sign for me to not you know, look at this place, but I don't know. That I don't like that. Hey guys, editing Deshaun from the future, literally today. So I didn't record an outro only because like the ending of the vlog just had me so pressed. Like, oh my gosh, just to basically sum everything up and I'll probably talk a little bit more about it in another video. Um, I was discriminated against when I went apartment hunting. So that lady did not want me up in there. She did not want to help me. She was trying to rush me, get me in and out of there. It, it was a really awful experience and it's something that I've never experienced before. And, um, you know, I, I wanted to keep all of that in there just so that, I don't know, you, this was my first time apartment hunting. You know, if there's anybody else that's in my shoes and you guys are watching this video trying to get an idea of like what to do, what to look for, um, that, is, that is an experience that is very real, especially if you are a person of color or a minority, um, that will happen. And um, I never thought it would happen to me, but it did. With all that being said, it's definitely not gonna end there. It's definitely not going to end there. But for now, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I put my foot in this, didn't I? I put my foot in this. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to follow me on all my social media. Follow me on TikTok, Instagram, um, all that. All that's linked below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. Bye.